of age. Doing very, very well in this pride. Mohammed from the DRC, welcome. I'm so happy to have you on the show. Marvelous, I suppose it's quite nice for you with the time. The DRC is probably quite similar. Oh, look at those teeth. Quite similar with regards to the time. I know a lot of our uh, other viewers are either watching very early or very late in the evening. Isn't that beautiful? You see the pink on the nose is often something to look at for age. Giraffe girl, you need to come. It is on your bucket list. It is a wonderful place to come. Look at those teeth. So often lions, when they start licking themselves, will then, or start yawning, they'll start licking, and then up they'll get and start doing some movement. You might first see an ablution stop, so they start with some grooming, start with some licking. They might have a toilet stop. Koki, the, the African lion, is a panthera leo, and I think the, the lions that you might find else, I'm trying to think where else you find lions in the world. Um, I'm, I've hit an absolute blank right now. I know that they are unique. This species is unique to Africa. It might move through into sort of um, the, the East, the Middle East area, but um, I honestly do not have an answer for you right there. Terribly sorry. And here, one of the lap wings in the background. Fantastic giraffe girl with your safari savings. Keep up the good work. We look forward to seeing you on the African continent in Juma, Sabi San, South Africa in the near future. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us on this very short broadcast. I hope you have a marvelous evening further. If you'd like to watch more, please Google Safari Live and continue the show. Have a good evening. There we go, and now back up. Look at her bum. Oh, that looks so sore, doesn't it? It looks like it's been opened. It was looking a lot better the other day, and it's possible that she got into the altercation again. Oh, shame. What a pity. But they're starting to get up. The wind is up. Much cooler than it was half an hour ago. Time for a bit of play. She is the oldest lioness in the pride, and she's still doing rather well. She's potentially the mother to most of them, or granny anyway. Mina, I think they do develop arthritis. I can't tell you for sure, but uh, one thing that you do see in, um, in lions in sort of the Kruger Park area is they do develop TB, and they start losing condition at an older age, and the TB is derived from the buffalo, and you'll often see them suddenly losing very, very a lot of condition, getting very skinny, and the bones stick out, and they seem to get swellings on the elbows, almost like a gout, but it is in fact actually TB that they've contracted, and whether that's got anything to do with your question about arthritis, I'm not sure, but it seems like they do get a bit old and stiff, but whether it's actually a diagnosed disease or affliction, I'm not 100% sure. But look at that, Crago. We have got some enormous clouds building up on the horizon, ladies and gentlemen. And um, have a 